So the imposter syndrome, guilty as charged. This means I tend to over prepare. And one challenge Barbara set for me for this recording is to do it in one take. So um, excuse the rough edges. Uh, this is one take, one take only, and uh, with very little preparation. I'm very vulnerable right now. Um, the, the imposter cinema for me, uh, I have been a Citrix specialist for many years before I started getting my hands dirty with PowerShell. And actually, I was pretty good with provisioning server at one point. And I went to the, the user groups and I thought, well, maybe it's nice to speak there at some point, but that never happened. Uh, I always thought there's a big crowd of people, all experts in the field. Who am I to tell them um, what this can do or what I experienced? It's just not enough. It, it won't be interesting for, uh, for those people. And that's just the thing. You don't need to be an expert. Um, you, you don't need to say something that everybody doesn't know yet. It's, it's okay to address a, a smaller portion of the people who are actually listening to you. Um, so now I'm in, in PowerShell and I went to a PSConf EU uh, 2024 this year. And I actually did two sessions and it was, I was nervous, sure. Uh, also, uh, it was very fun, and I overprepared, of course. Uh, this this made me comfortable. It's it's my way, I guess. So it's it's all good, <clears throat> and it did help me because my my sessions were well received. I got lots of compliments. People uh, enjoyed them, and that gave me a nice uh, nice boost in my energy. I even did a community demo afterwards at the end of the, the, the conference. It was five minutes on the big stage, so no more um, in, a, in a small room for 30, 40, 50 people, but for the entire conference speaking on, on a very big stage. Um, uh, but also that was fun to do. So I guess my message is, uh, yes, I can understand you feel a bit like an imposter uh, if you want to try to to address a, uh, a certain amount of people um, but that's okay i know so many people who went there for their first time and felt the same and still they went through with it and they they didn't die they didn't get laughed at it, it all went fine so if you're in doubt if you feel like this just take the leap I'm sure you have someone in your environment who can help you with this, with some experience and perhaps uh, ease you into it. So that's imposter syndrome for me.